In this lecture, we'll take a look at how we can work with AlpineJS and sidebar components. So here we have a sidebar created. Now using AlpineJS, we'll see how we can toggle it and that too without writing any JavaScript code. So the first thing that we need to do is here, introduce xData, open state, set to false. And that we're doing on the nav element. Now once that's done, we'll be expanding further and here, as you can see, this is the div which contains the sidebar. So for that, we have written x show equals open. So this will act when open will have a state set to true. And here we are also making use of click dot away. So when you're clicking away from the sidebar, basically, it will get closed because the state will be set to false. Now inside that we have a close button and on that we are setting open set to false. Now if I go ahead and save this, run it, you can see initially there's no sidebar appearing, but if I click on this hamburger icon, the sidebar appears. Now if I click on the close icon, this gets closed. Again clicking it on the hamburger icon, it brings it up. And now if I click somewhere else that's away from the sidebar, then that's also closes the sidebar and you can see all we have to do is just introduce some state and click events without writing any major javascript code